your plate? Plate. What's in your plate? GTA. What's, what's in your plate? Big plate. What's in your plate? Oh, oh, oh. What's in your plate? Plate. What's in your plate? GTA. What, what's in your plate? Big plate. What's in your plate? Oh, One thousand. What's in your plate? Plate. What's in your plate? GTA. What, what's in your plate? Big plate. What's in your plate? What's in your plate? Plate. What's in your plate? GTA. What, what's in your plate? Big plate. What's in your plate? One thousand. GTA. Kisa. What's good? Another day. Another video. GTF was good, man. Was good. Hey, GTF man, today just one of them days, y'all heard? I ain't gonna lie, I had other plans today. I wanted to go to Tampa today. You feel me? It's this little spot that I saw on social media that I wanted to go check out in Tampa. Um, the spot would have took me like four hours to get to. Four hours and some change. You could just say with stopping for gas and everything, maybe about four hours and a half. Um, but I was supposed to leave early in the morning if I wanted to drive four hours away. You feel me? Almost five hours away. But I ain't gonna lie, your boy kind of like overslept. By the time I woke up, I woke up at like six something. I was like, nah, I ain't gonna do it. You feel me? I wanted, to, I wanted, to, I wanted to leave at like. To be honest with you, I wanted to leave at like four a.m., like four thirty a.m. I woke up at like six. I was kind of tired. You feel me? Six a.m. is kind of late for me because I'm usually up earlier than that. I'm usually up at like four something. So I was like, nah, I'm just do it another day. You feel me? I was just kind of tired. You feel me? Like I ain't gonna lie, I wake up early all the time. So. It be them days that your boy wake up and your boy be tired, you heard? Like young thug dog, I be tired. So we gonna keep it local today, you feel me? There's this another spot that I wanna go check out. I ain't gonna say the name right now because I don't even know if they open, but they supposed to open at 11 a.m. It's like 10.45, I done called down there already. They ain't picking up the phone. Maybe they might be one of them places that pick up the phone exactly at 11, I don't know. So we ain't gonna say the name until we get there because they might not be open, you heard? All right, fam. We pulling up right now. All right, fam. We pulling in right here, y'all. All right, fam, we here, man. We on the strip with it, man. We in Overtown with it, you heard? Overtown floor. As you can see, man, we across the street from the Overtown Performing Arts Center, you heard? Y'all see the sign over there on the bridge, man. Welcome to the historic Overtown, established in 1896. You feel me? A lot of y'all might have done heard about Overtown on the first 48, you understand me? Overtown, baby, we in the hood, you heard? And we over here at House of Wings, man. Let's go in here. Yeah, fam, we here, man. We at House of Wings with it, you I ain't never been in here before, but this is my first time. House so of Wings over here in OT, man. A legendary overtime. You understand me? Y'all see what's going on, man. The legendary overtime. I don't know. We about to try these wings and see what's up with them. All right, fam. We got the grub, y'all. We got the grub. Fam, we over here in the legendary OT, you understand me? I ain't even gonna cap with y'all. Fam, I was gonna try to sit down and eat in there, you feel me? They got tables and chairs in there, but they playing the music. I ain't even wanna ask you, right? so we gonna just have this meal in the car. Uh, all right, fam, we in the whip yard, and we got the grub yard. Fam, y'all already know the vibe, now I'ma let y'all know the damage report at the end. But y'all already know. Time to set up Grub Tip Mobile Studios. Got to set up them studios, y'all. This car right here. I don't know. Stand real kind of weird. Like it kind of leaves the tray table. At a, it doesn't go down completely flat. So the tray table is kind of like at an angle. I don't like that. You understand me? I don't like that. But yeah, man, we went to uh, what that was House of Wings and um. Overtown floor. You feel me? Uh, let's pop this thing open. You hear me? Couple packets of ketchup, plastic utensils. You hear me? Menu. Let's 
should be leaking. Dang. Voila. All right, fam, that close-up action. As you can see, the wings looking nice and soaked, you heard? They call these ghetto wings. I got the ghetto wings combo, you understand me? And instead of getting french fries, I got onion rings. You feel? Y'all drop them comments, let me know what this thing looking like to y'all, man. I know it smells good. But yeah, fam, that's what we got. We got the combo, uh, the 10 wings combo, these ghetto wings, that's the flavor. We call them ghetto wings. The combo, I could have got a, a side of fries or onion rings, but I got the onion rings this time because I'm always getting fries. So I wanted to try the onion rings just to be different. You feel me? It also come with a drink. This is their uh, blueberry lemonade. They call it South Beach Lemonade, or blueberry lemonade, South Beach Lemonade, or what have you. You understand what I'm saying? So, uh, yeah, that's what we got. I'm gonna give y'all the damage report at the end. Fam, I ain't gonna lie. I'm looking at these onion rings. I mean, they look straight. But it just, to me, it just look like nothing spectacular. I mean, I haven't tasted them yet. I ain't gonna lie, they giving deco vibes. I ain't gonna cap with y'all, you feel me? Uh, I don't have no sauce to dip the onion rings in or what have you. But I do have this ranch. This is for the wings, I suppose. We gonna start off with these onion rings, though. Y'all see what the onion rings looking like? Onion rings. Hit that baby. I'm away! Mm. Yeah, I... They just playing onion rings. They ain't got no type of seasoning on them, if you ask me. I mean, they fried till golden. Feel me? The texture is cool. It just don't feel like it really got no seasoning in it. Like, they should have gave me some sauce or something. I don't think onion rings go with ketchup, does it? I'm not a big onion rings person. I don't always eat onion rings. I usually get onion rings from BK that come with that onion ring sauce. So, I don't know. I'm going to try to put the onion rings in the ranch and see what it do here. Dip, dip, dip. Hit that bit. Mm -hmm. Has a tangy flavor to the onion ring. It's not bad. With the ranch, it gives it a tangy flavor. The onion rings are most definitely edible. It just ain't really got much flavor. Like, I was... Maybe they should have battered this up with some with some seasoned batter or whatever. It's edible. The onion rings on a scale of 10. I get the onion rings a 5.1. It's edible. It's something to eat with the meal. We're gonna pour up this uh this South Beach lemonade they call it. Wash it down. Sabi so lemonade, not bad. Nice and sweet. It's not bad. That lemonade on point. All right, fam. So we gonna try one of these ghetto wings. Let's see what the ghetto wing looking like. Nice and soaked. And this uh, ghetto flavor. Smell like it got a lot of garlic in it. Yeah, that garlic. That garlic smell is potent. 
ghetto wing. Hit that bear. Bear? I like it. Hit the big yeah. Big? So it's given. Some sweet barbecue, sweet barbecue sauce vibe mixed with that uh, that garlic. It's pretty good. I'm messing with the wings. Hit that bit. We got a flat now. Hit that bit. Messing with that. It's tender, juicy. Filled with flavor. I like it. That ghetto wing, that ghetto flavor. Let me put the um, onion wings and some of that ghetto sauce. It's not bad. That ghetto flavor good though, I like it. The wings tender, they juicy. Because the barbecue, because the barbecue sauce is sweet, so it's giving sweet vibes and savory vibes. So you already know it's savory. By the way, this is a 10 wing combo. 10 wings. All right, so now, we're gonna take the wing. We're gonna dip it in this ranch. Drumstick, dip it in the ranch. Dip that bit. Hit that bit. Bit? That ranch even better. Dip that beer. Hit that beer. Mm. Those wings, right? If I go back again, I'll just get the wings. I mean, I'll try the fries next time. The wings most definitely right. Would I get the onion rings again? Nah. Yeah, I. They deco onion rings. Your boy killing the wings. Mm. 
that sauce, that ghetto sauce, right? I ain't gonna cap it, y'all. Yeah, fam. The wings good. So, for me, this doesn't matter, right? But I know for some of y'all, y'all say, oh, y'all don't like y'all wings soggy or whatever the case may be. So, this sauce, this ghetto sauce is poured all over the wings. So, the wings are drenched in it. So, when you bite it, it's not really as crispy as it would be if it was sauceless. You feel me? So, if you do go here, maybe you might, and you want crispy wings, maybe you might want to order the wings and the sauce on the side or what have you. But other than that, the wings are pretty good. I ain't got no complaints, you feel me? About the wings. I wouldn't order these, uh, what do they call them? I wouldn't order these onion rings again. But I ain't got no complaints about the wings. The South Beach Lemonade on point. The wings, oh boy! You feel me? The, the wings on a scale of one to 10, I'd get the wings are 8.9. I told y'all to give the, uh, what? What do they call them? I keep forgetting the name. The onion ring. I told y'all to get them. Onion rings of 5.1. Mm. South Beach Lemonade, 8.9. You feel me? Oh, yeah, fam. So, as far as the damage report goes, uh, I believe if I had bought the 10 wings by themselves, it would have been $10 and some change, like 10 35 or something like that but I got a combo which brings the uh, side which you can pick either fries or uh, onion rings and I got onion rings and I got and you get it with a drink you feel me well the drink didn't come in that cup the drink came in this well they got canned sodas too so but I got this I decided to get the uh, the South Beach lemonade they got watermelon and lemonade and a couple other different options of lemonade and and canned sodas but yeah 10 wings the side and the drink cost me $15, you heard? 15, you understand me? To be honest with y'all, that's not bad. $15, 10 wings, a side, and a drink. 15 ain't bad at all, you feel me? 15 ain't bad at all.